Hey, I just wanted to talk today about the top three mistakes I have made on Poshmark since I started, and hopefully you will make them too. My name is Marion, and I am a reseller on Poshmark, a little bit on eBay, a little bit on Facebook Marketplace, and I also send in to the real reel, and now I'm selling out of my whatnot closet. I just wanted to come on and tell you a little bit about my experiences. I did have a retail store until the end of 2021, and now I have a crap load of inventory. But let's just talk about the mistakes I made with Poshmark, with Poshmark on Poshmark. Number one, I didn't get things that were in trend or selling at the moment in the beginning. And still, I have those things, and we're talking many years later. So, make sure that you keep up with the trends, you keep up with what brands are selling, but with a grain of salt, because everything sells different for everybody, I'm finding, but there are brands that sometimes are right on key. You get them, you put them in your closet, they're going to sell so make sure that when you do buy things when you do go to the thrift stores garage sales estate sales when you retail arbitrage when you get things online that you know what's selling if you're selling on Poshmark look in Poshmark on what's trending you can go to eBay to see what's trending you can just ask Google what fashion is trending now. The second mistake I made was with keywords. I didn't use keywords. If I had a mug, <laughs> which is the mug I'm drinking at, but if I had mug, I would put in Tinkerbell mug green cute, something like that. Now, for a mug, what would I put in now? Tinkerbell mug, 12 ounces or 16 ounces. Nice shape, easy to hold. Green, Tinkerbell on one side. Tinkerbell, if you believe you can fly. I'd look on the bottom and see it is Disney. So Disney would be in there first. Disney Tinkerbell mug. If I was selling something that was what they call cottage core now, I would be sure to put in floral, well, let's say it's a name brand, okay? Abercrombie, floral, skirt, cottage core, country core, maxi, red, white, blue, whatever, but, and whatever the shape, I would learn my keywords so be very diligent is that the word I'm not sure but learn your keywords and learn them good well learn them the third thing I did was I really didn't share enough so if you're on Poshmark you want to share 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 whether you're doing it yourself or whether you have a, what's it called, um, bot, Poshmark Sidekick, I happen to love. I've been using it now for a few months. It has changed my reselling business. The link will be below, but that is definitely something that I should have done before. I was sharing, but since I have about 17, 1800 things in my closet, it is hard to share your closet more than once a day. So. Make sure you share, whether it's yourself, whether you hire an assistant, whether you get something like Poshmark Sidekick or Poshmark Sidekick, it definitely makes a difference. I am telling you, it changed my business. That's it for today. I just wanted to really share with you my mistakes so maybe you don't make them if you're just starting or even if you've been doing it for a while and you're saying, why, why is this not working? That was me. I don't want it to be you. If you like this video, give it a like, subscribe, and ring that bell if you want more content like this. And as always, I appreciate you so much.
I am the Smiley Thrifter, formerly Attire and Beyond, and that's what you could find me on all social media, where you can find me. And I appreciate you. Thanks so much. I'll see you on the next video.